What do you know about Aldo? It's raining ice! It's raining ice! Look, look, ice! It's raining ice in Kenya! God damn it, man! Look at this! Look, 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 ice! It's raining ice! What? God damn it! God damn! God damn it! Woo! Yeah! Rain and ice! I'm going to puke all over you. Here's today's card. It's tradition around here to show you the card, but it's not tradition to show you what's on the card, but you find out anyway because we'll talk about it. Guess what? New mic stand, new mic arm. Huh? Huh? No more of this guy. I like this guy. I like him a lot. And I still want to use him. Because he's better. Ouch. He's better than this. But the th I don't know, man. I don't know what to use. Don't fucking ask me questions. I got new headphones, and I also got what is known in the world as a capture card. Huh? <laughs> Does that tickle your little fancy? Because uh, we're going to do some uh, gaming. Hmm? We're going to do some gaming on the pod, on the P-O-D, D-O-O-D-D-O-3. We, well, we might. I don't know if I'll do it on the pod or if I'll do it separately. It doesn't fucking matter. Um, and my stream deck is frozen again. My stream deck is frozen again. Come on, man. Really? You guys got any oh. bags of bird ham in here? <laughs> we ran out of bird, bird ham. ham. Jackpot. 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 Oh, the body ass bitch! Jackpot. 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 Frankie. Okay, guys, let's do some dancing. Let's show me my, my moves. moves. The reason why I like this mic better than that mic for it's because you have to get right up in this bitch in order to hear anything. So any outside noise that comes around, you ain't gonna hear it. You ain't gonna hear it. You ain't gonna hear it. You, you, you. Oliver, get away from there. You get out of here. Get out of here now. Eh. You know what that just, that sounded like this. Eh. You're the best. You're the best little boy I ever met. I like making out with you. Yes, I do. Speaking of making out, have you ever been in a situation where, uh, you know, you got a girl or a guy or an it or a she or a zer or a zop or a cock or whatever the fuck? You ever, you ever have a significant other person, significant or not? But another person, and you say to yourself, I want to fuck you. I want to tickle your tonsils. I want to play with your bush. And she looks at you and she goes, no, dude, get away from me. You can't handle this. You ever have that? Are you bad at sexy talking? Well, I got the video for you. Since so many of you had questions about sexy talking, here's an exercise for you. You're I... just going to say hello, okay. but very, very slowly. Sure. First, say hello in your normal speaking voice. Can do. Hello. Now hello. slow it down. Hello. Let me try. Let me try. Hello. 
I'll do it like her with her tongue. Hi. All right, what's next? Awesome. Next, get Thanks. really excited and get a little higher up in your range. Okay. Hello. Hey. How was that? Good job. Thanks. Now we're going to pretend that we're really tired to access that lower range of sure. our voice. Sure. Uh, <laughs> uh, These exercises are great if you're a beginner singer, but they're also good if you just need a variety in your practice. Mm. Please comment below with any questions, and if I've you're interested lots. in voice lessons, visit my website, vochemusic.org. Um... Since so many. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. She makes a living doing this? I'm going to give her a like. You deserve it. Thumbs up for War Amps. What do the comments have to say? Oh, comments are turned off. Of course. Of course. I wonder why. I wonder why the comments are turned off. I can't think of any reason why they wouldn't be on. I can't think of a reason. <clears throat> she's just a lady teaching you how to sexy talk. And she's good at it. What was what was the point of this video? What is it supposed to teach you? Am I supposed to talk to women like that? Hello. What's up, girl? How are you? Huh? Mm -hmm. You like my sexy voice? You gotta have sex with me? Huh? How's that? that work? Any girls in the audience? Do you like that? Didn't think so. It's been... It's been one week since you looked at me. Um. There's a lot on my plate tonight. <clears throat> There's a lot on my plate. When I was prepping the videos for today, I was scrolling through the talk and I had the, there were certain videos that I would see and I would only watch them for about a second. And if I thought this could be, have potential, I would favorite it. I would pause it and favorite it and not watch the rest of it. So we're going to have some actual surprise video splashes today. Surprise. Last episode, I didn't use the Scroop scale. But this episode, I'm going to use the Scroop Scale. And there ain't nothing you can do to stop me, Gregory. Uh, I didn't fill the cup. I didn't fill the cup. I didn't fill the cup. Cup. You can't see it over here, but there's a uh, keyboard. Uh, not this kind of keyboard. Like, uh, you know, so once I figure out how to set it up properly, we're going to start doing some surprise beat splashes. You can't hear any of that because this mic is too far away and nothing's hooked up. But eventually, I can't believe it. It's dark. It's 649 in the P of the M and it's still dark. Anyone else live in Canada? It's cold still. March 6th, 2024. But today is the last... Is the last really cold day. Tomorrow, it's going to start to get warmer. And then Friday, it's going to be even more warm. And Saturday, it's going to be really warm. <laughs> well, not really warm, but it'll be zero... <laughs> Finger me booty. Okay, let's watch a video that I don't know what it's going to end up like. UFC 299 is this weekend. Are you watching? Because I am. I'm voting for Cheeto Vera. Hey, let's make a prediction. I think I'm going to say, I'm going to say in the, how? Oh, oh, okay. This pinches me. This pinches me a lot and I don't fucking like it. 
I like these headphones. Luckily, there are two different options for the cord, and I might have to use the other option because this is pissing me off. What's the point of the twist anyway? The whole rest of it's fucking straight. Why does this part have to be twisted up? It just pinches me. Where was I? Oh, yeah. UFC 299. This weekend, I'm saying Cheeto Vera beats Sean O'Malley, takes the title. And uh, Dustin Poirier and Benoit Saint-Denis. Ah, it's tough. That's tough. Here's what I think is going to happen. I want Dustin Poirier to win, but I think Benoit Saint-Denis is going to take it. That's my predicting. By the time this episode goes up, that that's going to... The fight's going to be long over. Hopefully I remember to specify the results in the next episode but either way it doesn't matter by the time you see this uh which you're not because no one watches but if someone's watching and you do watch this you can go back and look at the results of ufc 299 and you can tell me if i was right or wrong probably wrong ah it's it's nice seeing sean progress as far as he has and he's made a real name for himself. And honestly, I wouldn't care if it went either way. Because I do like Sean. But I love Cheetah Vera. Is that his name? Right? <laughs> uh, I'm still pretty fresh in the UFC game. I would be what would be considered a, uh, a casual watcher. Even though I have been uh, consistently watching every one since uh sean strickland defeated ah israel edesanya so i am a i am a newcomer into it i have i casually watched it you know in the past but over the past year or so i've been slowly dipping myself into it more and then the sean strickland and israel fight i really started to dip myself in and really started to enjoy it and now i watch every one I don't watch the fight nights, just the main UFC events. I don't know if you can hear any of this. Looks like you can. Anyway, here's Dana White. <coughs> God damn. Top five Dana White moments. I have not seen this video. <coughs> <coughs> I think I mentioned this before, but my sinuses are fucked. I don't talk this much ever. So when I talk on the podcast, it's like my sinuses fill up with snot and then I can't talk anymore. Every single fucking time, man. Yeah. I got to blow my nose. Like I'm not even joking. It's that bad. Get away from here, Oliver. I'll be right back. I got to blow my nostrils. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You would not believe the amount of snot and hairs that just came out of my mouth. I mean, my nose. It was unbelievable. I blew my nose. Just like 20 hairs, 20 nose hairs like this long were in the tissue. It was hair and snot. I've never had that much hair come out of my nose before. It's kind of blowing me away, to be honest. It's kind of blowing my nose, to be honest. I need to go and finger me booty. I need to go and finger me booty.
I guess it doesn't stretch any downward farther than that. I'm sure you're hearing a lot of crickles and crackles and mackles and boops. I might I might put this on here because this this can well hmm because if that's there then it can only move like that I don't know man I'll figure it out I just like this setup honestly I want to get a uh, this is a sure mic but I want to get the podcast mic that everyone has you know the one I'm referring to let's watch this video where are you going Oliver whoops doing what are you doing data people thought i was pink before <laughs> yeah look at me now yeah <laughs> former mexican what's that former mexican A former former mexican so Did you say former yeah wait I, hold on i can't hear it i gotta turn it up just say that <laughs> how the hell does that work <laughs> american now you used to be but now you're not he's an american so I want to oil you up. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> From Dublin, Ireland! The reigning, defending, 155-pound champion of the UFC, the notorious Conor McGregor! Hey, wait, I love the plug, but I haven't got to talk to you in a while. i got to tell you a new joke. This is going great. Around. What is six talking? feet tall? What is six feet tall dashing and disappears in an instant? What? Oh, he froze right at the punchline. <laughs> Dana, you stupid. You stupid, Dana. Dana stupid sometimes. Dana's a little dumb dumb. Hi, I'm Dana. I'm stupid sometimes. Nah, Dana's cool. He can't keep getting away with it. 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 He can't. Are you going to finish that croissant? 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 And this is your Captain speaking. We're gonna take off in about 50 minutes or so. Please follow the instructions of the flight attendants. Fasten your seatbelts. We're in for a rocky ride. Are you going to finish that Croissant. 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 Croissant? Are you going to finish that croissant? Are you? Are you going to finish? Are you going to finish? Are you? I'm really feeling like I'm getting back in the groove of this thing, and I kind of like it. <laughs> if you ever want to start, if you ever want to start a fucking podcast, a fucking podcast, and do it by yourself, and do it by yourself, then maybe you should quit. Um, it's not that hard. It's hard at first, but once you do it enough, stuff just pours out of you. It pours out of you like Aldo. You know Aldo, the TikToker? I do. It, 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 I do. It, it, it. I kind of wish I had that. This keyboard figured out. Because it would be really fucking cool to use it right now. Just make some beats. God, that would be nice, wouldn't it? You think I can't do it. You think I'm not capable of making a beat. You think I'm just going to fuck around on it and it's going to sound like shit and I'm going to think it sounds cool and you're going to feel really awkward and uncomfortable and skip past it and go, stop, please just do the podcast. But I'm telling you, I can do things. I can do things that you 
did not even imagine I was capable of. I can make beats for anyone, anywhere, anytime, even for this guy. Oh, 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 oh. You know you love me. I know you care. Just should we never and I be there. You want my love. You want my heart. And we will never, ever, ever be apart. How do we can hit them? Grill while playing. We're just friends. What are you saying? Say there's another. And looking right in my eyes. My first love broke my heart for first time. And I was like, baby, 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 whoa. Like baby, 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 no. Oh. Like baby, 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 whoa. I struck you always in my mind. Baby, 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 whoa, like baby, 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 no, like baby, 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 whoa, I still is always in my mind. For you, I will have done whatever. I just can't believe. Okay, guy. Okay, guy. Chill. There's my girlfriend who's watching. <laughs> is that how you say that? Chill, guy. My girl's watching. Chill, bro. Chill the f... <sighs> I just tickled my lip. So what do you think? Am I going to get claimed for that or what? It sounds pretty, uh, pretty accurate to the original. After these messages, we'll be right back. Never help. Never help. Never help is the best. It's anti-therapy and it's all about not getting yourself the help that you want, but giving yourself the trauma that you need. If you're thinking about starting anti-therapy, give Never Help a try. It's entirely done online and it's designed to be convenient and flexible, suited to your schedule. You can do it from the comfort of your own home. Fill out a brief questionnaire, get matched with an unlicensed therapist. You can switch your unlicensed therapist at any time for no additional charge. Never Help connects you with an unlicensed therapist who can take you on that journey of self-discovery and self-mutilation from wherever you are. That's right, just discover your potential with NeverHelp. Visit neverhelp.com slash gizmo today to get yourself a free hemp fiber noose with your first month. Why not give it a try? Traditional therapy is usually a little bit more expensive than this, and it's harder to get around and fit into your schedule. In this regard, you can do it at your own time when you want. That's neverhelp.com, never, H-E-L-P dot com slash gizmo. Okay, so there's one other thing I wanted to discuss. Speaking of UFC, since we were down that rabbit hole, uh, you know Ryan Garcia? Let me give him a quick goog here. Oh, I hope I wasn't... I hope he could hear me. Let's stay there. I don't know how I feel about this mic stand. It's kind of shitty. Well, this this can come closer. You can just pull the computer closer, you fucking stupid idiot. Yep. Fucking lovely, man. That should do it, right? <laughs> Put a smile on your face. Sing a little, laugh a little, I love you. Cute little kittens wear warm little mittens. Warm little mittens, they're cute little kittens. Cute little kittens wear warmest mittens that meow meow upside down. I look at the happy things, the happy things, the happy things. I look at the happy things, turn that frown upside down. Ryan Garcia. 
Who is he? Ryan Garcia is American professional boxer. Boxer. He held the lightweight interim, interim lightweight title in 2021. Have you been have you been following him? Have you been hearing about him? Even if you don't know who he is, you've heard his name tossed around, haven't you? <laughs> Ryan Garcia. I guess he got kidnapped by the Illuminati. The Illuminati got him. And they took him to Bohemian Grove. And mm, he saw some shit. Lettuce. Ugh. Yuck. Throw it on the floor. Throw it on the floor on camera so everyone can see. Fucking idiot. Anyway, he, I guess the Illuminati got a hold of him. The Illuminati. Can you see that? I don't know. Can you see that? The Illuminati got him. And they took him to Bohemian Grove, and he saw some shit, and now he's freaking the fuck out, and he's all over the internet, and Andrew Tate got a hold of him and said, hey, man, what's going on? Talk to us. Bro, I don't give a fuck, bro. They held me down, and they made me watch the little kids get raped. I don't give a fuck anymore. Where? Bro, they fucking took me to the fucking woods, bro, and they fucking tied I'm not fucking joking, bro. I have fucking proof, bro. I don't give a fuck. Bro, I fucking will show you every fucking video you could ever fucking believe. Bohemian Grove is real. They fucking tied me down, and they made me fucking watch, dog. I absolutely don't give a fuck anymore. Yes? He doesn't want to take us all. Talk to us. Bro, I don't give oh, a fuck, bro. They over? held me down. Okay. Why did they take Ryan Garcia? Out of all the people they could take, why'd they take him? I'm not saying he's a liar. I'm not saying he's a truther. I'm not saying he's a denier. I'm not saying he's a pooper. But what I am saying is, why'd they take him? Why'd they take him? Out of all the people they could have taken, why'd they take Garcia? This isn't even the, the video I wanted to watch. There's a longer version of this. What does this say? What does this say? What does this say? Can I zoom in? Okay. Uh, he tweeted this. Are the people going to get behind me or let them kill me? That's the real question. Let Ryan die or help me? Are you guys cr the crazy ones? Because I'm not lying. They are hurting kids. And everyone is standing back telling me to shut up. And I don't care anymore. I'll die for innocent souls taken. If you aren't on my side, you are on the devil's side. They held me down and made me watch, of course. Wait, uh, they held me down and made me watch. Of course I've lost a little, lost it a little. They really begged me to join, and I said, fuck you. Oh. Wow. Interesting. Okay, so they're trying to get him to join the Illuminati? Is that what the process is? So it's like, imagine all these celebrities are in the Illuminati and this is what they had to go through and they all just accepted it because it was just so vile and there's no way they could get away from it. Oh man, I just, after all these years of so-called Illuminati shit, why did it take until Ryan and Garcia for any of it to come out like this? What's he tweeting now? Well, he did say earlier that uh, he's not going to talk about this anymore because he needs to focus on training because he's got a fight coming up. Here it is. As I've stated, I will only be talking about boxing. This was two hours ago. Let's see who's really listening. Ask me any boxing question. On a plane back to go train with Derek in Dallas. So why not do a Q&A of boxing and sports? Oh, this was the one. I, Ryan Garcia, will not be speaking or tweeting or writing anything other than my fight, boxing, and sports. 
All topics of discussion will be discussed after my fight. Five weeks of focus. You have my word. I'm locked in. I'll see you 420. Okay. So he's not going to talk about it anymore until after he fights. And then he's going to come back out and talk shit or what? Hold on. I got to sneeze. Holy fuck. Oh. Oh my god. I just sneezed. What's this video? All praise Yeshua. I'm speaking in tongues. Don't worry. Um, those who are prophets know. Those who are priests know. Those who are evangelists know that speaking in tongues is is real. But um, these things are happening. What? Dude, shut up. What the fuck? Okay, now he just seems like a crazy asshole. Look at this. <laughs> Ryan providing the video evidence. Yeah, he said he had video evidence. On that video, on that clip we just listened to of him talking to Andrew Tate, he said to Tate, I have video evidence. But he also said he's waiting till after the fight to continue talking about this shit. I don't know. I don't want to stay on this topic for too long. I just thought it was weird. I thought it was a little strange. I also think this podcast doesn't have to be over an hour long either. And it's not. I'm not saying it is at that point. But most of them are, and it doesn't have to be. Although myself, I must say, as a person who enjoys podcasts, I'm kind of obsessed with podcasts. I said pop. Podcasts. I um I like a long podcast. The longer the better. The better the longer. Like three hours is a great time. Joe Rogan hit the nail on the head. And he's back on YouTube. I'm so happy. I don't have to fucking rely on Spotify. I would like to watch my podcast on the television like everyone else. And like these guys who are watching the game in silence because they're, they made a bet that they couldn't do it. And I want you to watch it how fucking cool this is. <laughs> Look at them. Oh my god. Like who <laughs> The one guy tripped over the guy that was already on the floor. And as he was falling he tripped the other guy. Watch it again. Watch it again cuz it's it's one of my favorite videos. Play. Come on. <laughs> And the beer spilling. Oh, man. Look at the grandma. Or is that a grandpa? I don't know. Either way. A great video. Oh, it's great, huh? It's great. Uh, oh, here's another one that uh, I don't know what's going to happen because I uh, haven't seen it. I have not seen it. These are perfect Scroop scale videos because I have not seen them and it could go bad or it could go good. So I just saw a farting and there's a horse and a lady. So let's see. You want to know what he really hates? I'm going to step back for this one. <laughs> we only can do this one once because... <laughs> Okay, farts are funny, but uh, animal farts are not that funny. Well, they can be. They most certainly can. I have a whole folder full of farts. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, for fuck's sakes, come on. She's frozen. Uh, 
I'm so sick of this stream deck, dude. 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 Boom zoom to doom zoom boom 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 boom zoom to boom zoom boom zoom 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 boom zoom boom zoom zoom boom boom zoom boom zoom zoom boom zoom 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 boom okay here's six seven. And it's frozen and shut down again. I don't want to wait for my lunch to get colder. So I think what the problem is, these are old sounds, and they might not be in the same place that they used to be. That, that That's no excuse for it to crash every time I want to fucking fart. But there's certain ones that always work and other ones that just cause it to crash. All I want to do is walk away. <laughs> you remember that TikTok? Jackpot. Thank you, Steve. Thanks. Thanks, Steve. All right, let's let's do this. I've been waiting to do this for a full fucking week. I might have been waiting to do this even longer. What is it you say? If you eat a pretzel and then a grape, it tastes like fried chicken. I promise you, I'm not lying. Mm. Pretzel. Pretzel. Grape. What do you think, boys? Wait, what do you do? This guy thinks it tastes like fried chicken, am I right? You know what I'm saying? Fried chicken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's fried chicken or what? All right. Let me test this. Let's test it. I got I got the professional some fucking rolled gold, dude. You can't beat this. This is the genuine fucking tiny twist, classic style, classic kiwi. Uh mini tort tortillions, pretzels, pretzels. What the fuck? Pretzels in French is pretzels. <laughs> Can you see that? Pretzels and in French it's pretzels. If you ever because if you're if you're in Canada, every package has to be in English and French. How fucking stupid is that? I'm just kidding. And then I got grapes. Good old what does it say here? She she -geen. Extra fresh grapes. I bought these. Oh, it's a sticky mess. Ugh, my table's going to be all fucking sticky now. I was going to prepare a little better and put them in a bowl, but then I forgot three times. And last minute, right when I hit record on everything, I'm like, ah, I forgot the fucking grapes again. So let's get into this. You want some ASMR? Rolled gold, baby. Rolled gold. How loud is this? I don't even know. All right, so he ate the pretzel first, right? Let me watch this again. If you eat a pretzel and then a grape, it tastes like fried chicken. I promise you I'm not lying. All right. So we choose on the pretzel for a bit. And he pops the grape in. I want to do this exactly the way he does it because I've seen people on the internet do this and they, they either don't use proper pretzels like the... Uh, they'll use like a seasoned pretzel bite or they'll like they'll chew the whole pretzel and swallow it first and then pop the grape in or they'll pop the grape in first and then the pretzel nah I'm doing it exactly the way this guy does it because I want to see so here we go pretzel grape Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. No way. Hold on.
Whoa! Dude! <sighs> oh my god. I'm not even joking. That tastes like... That tastes like fried chicken. <laughs> okay, anyone who's tried this online and says it doesn't, it fucking does, dude. Get the rolled gold and get the Walmart extra fresh grapes. Bro, I'm doing two pretzels. Oh, he's right. He's fucking right. The cons you got to get past the consistency because it's crunchy but soft in your mouth. So it's in your head. You're thinking it's not chicken, but <laughs> it. No, actually, the consistency kind of helps. Actually, let me do this again. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. Okay. He's right. He's right. All you other fuckers, all you other fucking idiots on the internet who tried this and said it doesn't work, you're stupid. Get the rolled gold, classic, you know, the OG high quality pretzies. And get the fucking green bag of, there's no brand, it just says extra fresh gr Extra fresh. God, those pretzels are good. You can't beat rolled gold, man. <clears throat> I'm choking. There's pretzels in my throat. <clears throat> jackpot. This is jackpot. This is absolutely scrupulously. Uh, gold, dude. It's rolled gold. Bye. Ew, there's hairs all over this. Hairs in my nose, hairs all over my mic. Buy the rolled gold. Buy the extra fresh grapes. And dude, I'm telling you, it's fucking fried chicken. He's not lying. It's seriously fried chicken. That's blowing me away. I honestly was going into this thinking it wasn't going to work because I saw Joe... Uh, what's his name? Joe Bartolozzi do it. And uh, he said it didn't work. But like I said, he was using some bullshit fucking pretzel. He wasn't using legit OG fucking rolled gold. He had the proper grapes, I think. But uh, his pretzel game was off. Don't be a bish. Don't be a bish. Anyway, let's end it off with this uh, video here of an AI-generated video. Have you seen these? This AI technology, how fucking crazy it is? It creates these videos. As far as I know, this is AI. It's like security cam footage, completely AI-generated, of whatever it thinks the world is like. 
You'll know the style of it when you see it. It's just, yeah, just watch it. Is the spaghetti really necessary? Is there an ice cream on my head? Yep. Wow, you have a lot of hair. Thanks. That's a lot of foam. What's with the popcorn dog? Is there a frog on my head? Yes. Like, they're just all like this. Like, there's ones, uh... uh let me just go to this guy's channel. Blue Wish. Blue Wish? This one. It's like cops. Let arrested. go of the giant apple, sir. <laughs> no! You're enjoying haircut. Uh, no! What's with the eggs, dog? Dang. <laughs> Seriously, dog? Eggs. Could you stop following me, please? I love lemon. <laughs> Let go of the giant apple, sir. No! <laughs> this one's great. I like this one way better. I'm covered in foam, dog. Wearing haircut. Uh, no. What's with the eggs, dog? Dang. Seriously, dog? Eggs. Could you stop following me, please? I love lemon. Let go of the giant apple, sir. No! You enjoying haircut? Uh, no. What's with the eggs, dog? Wait, why is everyone in the comments saying, I'm covered in foam, dog? Is that a different video? I don't know. This one's great. I like it. Let's start scrooping. Okay, let's end it off with a scroop. We're going to scroop these. Um, so, baby Justin Bieber, baby Papa Giger, Fata Fushi Fever, Hasa Fushi Fever, Masa Fushi Fever, Hasa Justin Bieber. Um, I don't know if I want to use this scale, dude. This is stupid. This is stupid. Isn't it really dumb? It's like pretty fucking dumb, isn't it? I'm not, not doing it. No, I'm not doing it. It's bullshit. It's it's stupid. It's fucking dumb. What am I going to do? Rate every video? Like, go fuck yourself. I'm not scrooping. I ain't scrooping, and you can't make me. Now, go, go to Walmart or wherever. Buy yourself some rolled gold and some grapes, extra fresh grapes, and get to chew it. That's it for this episode of the Dynamite Gizmo Podcast. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and, and then unsubscribe, and then de hit that bell notification, and then delete your comment, and then unlike the video, and dislike it. Bye!